Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Grow and Clip Bonsai for Seniors. Today is June 23rd of 2021. It's a late Wednesday night around 10 o'clock in the evening. It's 74 degrees Fahrenheit or 24 degrees Celsius. This is geranium part three. I'm going to repot it from a root maker's pot, and I'm going to show you my one-year-old. The soil that I'm going to use for repotting is a one-part worm castings, two-part peat moss, two parts perlite, or if you don't have any of that, you can just use a plain ordinary cactus mix. So here's last year's that overwintered for me. And you can see in, in, the, in the winter time, the leaves are all pale, but look at the, the nice dark leaves when it's in full sun. And I got the little guys underneath there sitting under the shade. And then I got my marker on there so I know when I planted it. And they do survive the winter. You just got to give it a, the best window you can find in the house. Now the pot I used was from an old fountain. I just was, the fountain was so easy to take it off that I was able to make a pot out of it. And then all the, the scratches on the inside and stuff, I just put silicone in there and I just put some uh, Peace River gravel in there. And now I got a nice little, nice little pot. So, here's our other geranium in the root maker's pot. I think there's two in there. You can see the flowers on it. So, I know this is drastic, but I have to cut the flower buds off because I want to repot it and give it vigor into the, into the roots and to get it to grow. So right now, I'm just going to take the flowers off. A shame to do it but what are you gonna do so I'll put them in here for now okay remember the old chapstick again for free when you go to eat at a, at a Asian restaurant it's got a nice rectangular head which fits the root makers pot perfect but this is a different type of root maker's pot, so I'm just going to push it out through the bottom and it's coming out nice and easy. This is a different design. So now I'm going to take my root rake. I wish you can smell it. It smells really good. There's two in here. I'm just going to take as much as I can out because I, I rooted it in uh, peat moss. So we're just going to break it up the best we can because we want it to grow. Get that all out of the way. And then I'm going to take my scissors and cut it in half. Because the roots, they still got all summer to grow, so I want them to get vigor and grow. And we're going to split these in two. Now, now's the time to get your geraniums because they're going to start running sales on them. And a lot of places got them for like 50 cents just to get rid of them. But here's like a, a triple trunk. And here's our single trunk. So all I'm going to do is cut it back. It's something very easy for you to do when you get rewarded by having flowers. So just try it out. Not hard to do. So, i put my pot in, get my soil, and then here's my marking stick. You know, if you don't have a stick, just use an old popsicle stick. And how do you prevent it from rotting? Paint the bottom. Get an old paint marker and just paint it. And then you can mark it. 
and you'll have it and it's not going to rot. I got it down to soil level so that way there it doesn't rot or anything else. So let's get started planting. Can't beat around the bush, let's get it going. Got the screen in the pot. Here's my soil, how it looks. I'm going to take this back a little bit. I'm going to put one tree here. And the other one we're going to put right about here. Just moving it over, getting it in. It's just something different, something that you can have and it's a fast, easy growing plant. And if you make a mistake, you don't have to worry about it because it, what is it going to cost you? 50 cents or 79 cents, whatever they are on sale now. You can go to Lowe's and sometimes they have them in the, I call it the junk section where they don't water them in. Nobody took care of them. And they're all getting pukey looking, but you can take the pot home, give it some good tender loving care with water and fertilizer, it'll bounce right back. And you'll have your own little your own little bonsai tree. And you can see it did last. And all I did was put the Peace River gravel in that other one. And I didn't have a expensive pot. All I did it was use was the mushroom tray. And look how nice that turned out. So you can really do anything that you set your mind to. Now I'm going to take my little measuring cup, put it in, fill it up. The roots will develop. You just got to give it time because it's summer. And they will grow. And this is a good draining soil. I'll take my little elephant and water them in real good. Now they say you're not supposed to put them in direct afternoon sun. But mine are in direct afternoon sun and they survive. Because they can grow in uh, full sun or partial, sh or partial shade. And you'll still get a nice plant out of it. Just work it in good. The roots are real fine, so I'm not using a chapstick by breaking the roots a little bit. It helps get them used to growing into new soil. So there we go. Now if you want to do something different, let's wet it down real good with the pot. Get all the stuff off. Any pot will do. There you go. Nice and easy. You got your own little rewarding little tree. Remember, if you're going to cut some of the dead leaves off, always dip and clip because you don't want to spread no diseases on there. And the best thing to do when you water your geraniums, if you water from the top, do it during the during the morning time because that way the leaves have a tr chance to dry out. But try not to wet the flowers because the fly flowers won't last them. So there you go. Nice little tree. Nice little forest setting. Now we can make that as a little pathway in between. We'll take some of our gravel.
I'll make a little pathway there. That will use our spoon. And a geranium is real easy to try out. And you don't have to worry about losing money. It's 50 cents. If that. And it's something easy for you to try. Real easy. Little path. That's all you need to dress it up. And if you have a little rabbit, we can stick our little rabbit in there. We can have him sitting over here on the side looking at the path. And then we'll take our stick and we'll put it behind one of the trees so you can't really notice it. And there you go. A little forest setting done. One, two, three. Look at that. You're all done. So don't be afraid to try it out. The geraniums are going to be going on sale cheap, so grab them. And even look in the junk, se junk section. If you find some that they might even be a quarter, just try them out. So today's Wednesday night. I listen to some old-time radio shows on Wednesday. Uh, the detective shows like uh, Sherlock Holmes and Dr. Watson or uh, Gangbusters or I think I forgot some of the other ones like uh, Boston Blackie. We got some good old time radio detective shows. So, some some good old fashioned who done it. So take have a cup of tea, turn on one of the detective shows that you like, sit back and relax and have a nice evening. And thank you for coming to Grow and Clip Bonsai for Seniors. Take care, everybody.